Now, the Israeli defense forces have successfully reached tunnels in Gaza twice, almost catching hold of top Hamas leader Yahya Sinwar. And now, according to the report, Sinwar had narrowly escaped from the tunnel right before the IDF managed to reach him. IDF spokesperson said it had specific information about the tunnel where Sinwar was hiding. However, he fled the tunnel only a few hours before this raid was conducted. Now, local media outlets reported earlier that IDF operations have been focused around the southern Gaza city of Khan Yunus. This with the primary objective of killing Yahya Sinwar. Sinwar has, Sinwar has escaped capture by the IDF twice in recent days. Further, other reports also indicate that the Hamas leader is on the move and hasn't been staying in one place for a long period. Now, this manhunt led the Israeli troops to uncover a previous hiding space of Muhammad Def, the commander of Hamas military wing. Earlier on Sunday, Israeli soldiers raided the vacation homes of several Hamas leaders, Sinwar being one of them. The IDF captured the office of Hamas's Khan Yunus Brigade commander, this along with the underground terror infrastructure as well. Now, the forces also captured the main square of Bani Suhela, which is a suburb of Khan Yunus. Sinbar is currently believed to be hiding in Khan Yunus. He had earlier fled the north of the Strip by using a humanitarian convoy during the ongoing conflict with Israel. Despite other reports, there's no confirmation of his residence in Khan Yunus. Israeli forces have called Sinwar the mastermind of the October 7th attack, the worst attack their nation has ever faced when hundreds of Hamas gunmen crossed the borders and rampaged through towns. Now, as the conflict intensifies, Israel vows to continue its operations until reaching senior Hamas officials.